Hey what's going on guys welcome back to the VFX showdown and today is the quick tutorial to show you how you can export OBJ file inside of After Effects with Element 3D. So we all know the Element 3D you can import Cinema 4D and OBJ files right inside of After Effects and you can actually export the OBJ files I mean you know all the element 3d have e3d file dot e3d so if you want obj element 3d can do that for you let me show you what i mean so let's make a new comp and this setting looks good hit ok and let's create a new solid called this e3d so let's type in effects and preset element here is the video couple element drag and drop in this black solid and let's go to the scene setup and as you can see this is the starter model pack and I have another models as you can see these are the call of duty weapons pack so if you want this pack I link in the description for that so you can easily download and install and play around so in this example I am going to choose one of our model let's this axe as you can see this axe let me just rotate like that. ok so as you see this is pretty cool axe let's go to the environment and change to the town this uh, looks good okay so let's turn off draft texture so you can see the full quality as you see this axe have pretty good quality and these are and these are the all materials as you see let me show you as you see these are the all materials for that axe and when I export this the materials on all these properties will export in obj file so this pretty cool as, as you see this is a rig you can rotate and basically have more controls so let's undo okay so this is the model and how you can export in obj so let's hit okay and let's make a camera to show you OBJ. Let's okay. It is not as you see this one. Okay, so we want to export this model to share with my other friends and with you guys. So, how I can do that? So, go to the element, and here is the option called utility. So, open it utility, and as you see, group export. So as you see all groups we change to group 1 because this model have in group 1 so choose the group 1 and as you see export obj's so let's quickly generate and first you need to enter the name so I call this element okay and choose the location I have created this folder after if obj files as you see okay and hit save so as you see it's exporting and it's done so if i go back in my folder where you download as you see these three folder will create it by itself so first is the element 3d pack three, sorry element 3d model extension as you see element dot e3d and this is the mtnl and this is the obj what you want so as you see this is the obj and the size as you see 5 megabytes so if i close this and close the utility go to the scene setup and delete that model here go to the import as you see import 
and here is the my default so here is the element obj file and element e3d file so if i open this see what happened selected obj open load that default material okay hit okay and boom we have that obj file right inside of element 3d so with material texture and all the properties we're doing in this element it's right inside back for you so this is pretty cool way to import and export your element pack with your friends and other pre-production groups etc so guys hope you like this quick tutorial to show you how element 3d is very useful in after effect so guys thank you so much for watching if you have any question leave in the comment below and stay connected to vfx showdown for more tutorial like this and we will see you in our next one have a great day bye